What is going on guys, Jack of the Zombie here and we are doing another unboxing video. Hello dog, come on, join me, join me. We are doing another unboxing video because I have in, in my mail area, what are you barking at? What? 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 In my mail area received something that I have been waiting for for like a week. And it's going to be another big way that I'm going to upgrade my system. And what I mean by that is I have finally, make sure I show you guys the right side, ah, purchased a gaming monitor. Now what this is, is the AOCG, somewhere down here, 2260VW, stop it with the squeaky. Something G2260VWQ6. It is a 21 and a half inch monitor, which I'm sure you can see as well. It has a 75 megahertz refresh rate, which means it'll be able to show you 75 frames per second instead of the standard 60 that most people have. And it also has DisplayPort. So what I'm doing with this is finally upgrading. Mm -hmm. My, I'm sorry about the mess on the desk, if you guys can see that and everything behind there, but uh, I'm finally upgrading my two monitor setup to a triple monitor setup. And when I say that, it's probably not what you think, because I'm not adding this one to the, to the setup. What I have done is instead purchased three of these monitors to add to my setup. So I'm going to start running triple of the gaming monitors on my primary setup. The two that I have right now, those are going to go to my secondary setup. And with the addition of my TV, which when I feel like playing with the controller, that's normally what I do. I'll throw it on the TV and just play sitting right here on bed. On the bed. The bed. you got to have the word the in there, otherwise it doesn't make much sense. Hi, can you stop smelling my things, please? I will give you your toy in one moment. You just hang tight. Just hang tight. You're very cute. I don't know why she does this. I don't know why. Every single time, every single time I want to record something and try talking, she has to go find a toy that will squeak. Yes, yes, it's over there. It's over there. Just, just, it's okay. Just let it happen. Just let it happen. What? Well, I think we need to open one of these boxes and actually check out these monitors. If I have a knife around here, I don't have my knife in my pocket, which is, which is very new, but that's because I got in trouble for having it at work. So I stopped keeping it in my pocket. I could probably just pull this tape off though. Do it! Do it! I'm doing it! Oh, we're so close! We're so close! Give me the keys! Give me the keys! Ah! My god! Boop! And... Boop! Perfect! Wonderful! Awesome! Great! Pop that guy! Pop that guy! And let's get this box open, dog! Will you get out of my way? Go away! Go on! Go on! Get going! We can see what we have in one of these boxes. Boop. We have this, which is, from the looks of it, a VGA cable. Perfect. Awesome. Normal thing you'd expect to come with the monitor. We have this, which from the looks of it, perfect. Awesome. Power cable. We also have styrofoam. Great. Wonderful. Awesome things there. We have the monitor which has a red outline to it according to uh, the ad. I'm not sure if they sent me that exact one. No, they did not. Yes, they did. Okay, so we do have red on it. And the cool thing about that is that my uh, current build that I did, when I rebuilt my computer, I actually have red accents all over my motherboard and everything else. One thing I am noticing though is that this said that it came with a uh, cable for HDMI as well as DisplayPort. And I'm not seeing those in the box so far. So let me just pop out the rest of the styrofoam. We'll see if maybe they're tucked down on the bottom. We got some stuff in there. So we got just the, the regular mount for the monitor. And we have instruction booklets. So yeah, they said it came with a display port cable and um, what was it? HDMI cable. It was supposed to come with all three, which actually kind of weirds me out to start with because the monitor that I ordered did not have VGA according to the site. It had DVI. It was supposed to have DVI, HDMI, and DisplayPort, and it looks like they less screwed to me. 
And it, it's the right monitor, but they just had some incorrect listing on there. That's fine. I can just run down and pick up the DisplayPort cables because I do want to be running all three of these as DisplayPort monitors. So I'm going to get that going, get these up and running, and then I'll probably check back in with you guys, show you guys exactly how I have them laid out, make it nice and pretty, and see what we've got going on. So give me one second. All right, update. I have kind of sort of set up my monitors um, for the past two days. Yes, two days. That last clip was recorded on Monday. It is currently Wednesday. For the past two days, I've only been using two of my three monitors because of the fact that uh, the DisplayPort cables didn't come with it, which I discovered is because U.S. does not send them with it, whereas Europe does. So when I was actually looking at the specs of the monitors, I was checking the Europe site and I didn't even realize it. So that's going to be my bad. But on Monday night, I had actually looked everywhere for DisplayPort cables. And like Walmart didn't have them, Best Buy didn't have them. I've got a couple local uh, computer repair places, none of them had them. So I ended up getting on to Amazon and ordering them, which I'm trying to kind of cover everything. But this is the box. I ordered them and uh, with Prime, it's like two-day shipping. So I got them today. Boom. DisplayPort cables. I got a two-pack and a one-pack because the two-pack was like a dollar off or something. So now I do have the cables to start hooking everything up. So I'm going to finish this. I'm going to get everything nice and pretty. I'm going to unfortunately put my tower back down underneath the computer. I know I just did the... Uh, setup vlog where I showed that it was up on top now and while you get three 22 inch monitors on your desk it tends to take up a little space and I gotta keep the tower out from front of the window because summertime is coming and I'm gonna have to throw the air conditioner back in there so I don't want to have the cool air hitting right on the side of the case that's not gonna be any cap of good so I'm going to get everything all situated and we're gonna do another check in and probably just show you what I've got going on including my other setup which I have also changed around and uh, the reason I changed that around is just because it was like uh, it was kind of clunky I had it on that little black table before and the table was actually right here I literally just pulled it down this is the table let me see if I can't show you this in a fancy way so right here round battery now this is sitting flat you see that and it goes that way, comes back. It does that all the way down this entire table. It caves in really bad in the middle. So for just having one monitor sitting on it, that was completely fine. Completely fine. You just center the monitor, no big deal. But since I have the three new ones, my two old monitors are going to be a dual display for my secondary computer. And... On this little table, not really much room to do anything with, so I did actually pull out of storage my old dining room table. So it takes up a lot more room. It's the it's the same width. I think it's uh, 48 inches, but now in... No. Yeah, 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 48 inches. But instead of it being 23 inches, 22, 20 inches, I don't know, 20-something inches, now it... I think it is like 24 inches. I think it's a 48 by 24. Doesn't matter. Now it is 48 by 32. So I have a lot more room to do all types of pretty stuff and I do actually have that completely set up. It's right over there hiding, but I won't be showing you that until I show you this, which is my beautiful three monitors here. So we're gonna get that done really quick and then I will uh, probably peek back at you but it might not be tonight it might be tomorrow or the next day it might be the next clip so you guys probably aren't going to see this until next monday which is kind of weird because i wanted to do it get it all set up nice and pretty and then have it out to you guys the next day i wanted to have it on tuesday the twenty fifth twenty fourth it's twenty sixth Tuesday is the 26th is when I wanted to have this video out to you, but now it's looking more like back to the calendar. The third looks like will be the day this video might be going live or the second. Monday is the second. Why can't I figure out my days?
Okay, it seems we have gotten things set up, for the most part. Um, I, I ordered those parts in, I got the cables, I got it all hooked up, I moved my computer from the other side down below once again, like I said I would, and then, um, I, seriously, every time, every freaking stinking time, listen, you'll hear it, um, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. No ducky. And uh, I moved it down to the bottom and then I moved it up. You guys actually might hear it right now. Also, about the audio quality, if it's a little weird, I'm trying out that other microphone again. Um, I kind of want to see because it seems to be hit or miss. Like sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. But this video is going to be late. Today is uh, May 2nd, Monday. And in the last clip, I said that I wanted to try to have it out on Monday or Tuesday I believe I said but um on Thursday the day after the last clip was recorded um, my grandmother had a stroke and we ended up losing her so it kind of jumbled everything up so I am recording this late it's gonna be up late and um, I just wanted to Apologize for that because I know I, I know I said that I was gonna try and get it out to you I believe I even talked about it on Twitter and then earlier in this video. I talked about it. I'm sure you guys understand with what's going on, but um, Things just got kind of hectic and her, her funeral is gonna be tomorrow Tuesday tomorrow and After that we should be able to get back onto a regular regular schedule from there but I do want to still try and get this video up and out to you guys just to at least give you guys a heads up on what's going on. I already let the V4V guys know what's going on on the Skype chat, but as far as uh, viewers go, you guys pretty much have no idea. But I suppose it would be a good time to start showing you the setup, which... <laughs> you got a cute little dog here. Hi! Hello! How are you doing today, Miss Dog? <laughs> Stupid. She wants her toy so bad. She does. She really wants it. Try and get it pulled back up on here. Attempting to reconnect and oh, oh, is it doing it? Is it doing it? We have it. Just wanted to make sure the lighting is good while I show you guys around. So this is the uh, triple display. You guys can see I have the tower set up over here. It's still the exact same beautiful tower. But now it is no longer down here, and actually let's scoot this chair out of the way. If you guys remember before, oh you can see I still got the uh, LED keyboard running nice and strong. But um, if you guys remember before, I had just a butt jumble of cables down here, and I actually went and I, I mounted it. Um, I'm not sure if you guys can really see that. Let me... Fresh right on my phone. So right there, I have everything mounted and then just routed through the the microphone hole, and that's actually seeming to work really, really, really well. Let me get back to my camera lens here, attempting to reconnect. Why do you take so long? What is wrong with you? Let's look at the dog while we're doing this. She's looking for a toy. <laughs> oh, you crazy dog! It says my camera's off. Okay, but now it's showing. I don't know what's going on with this thing. But here is the second setup now. Oh, again, that is the darkest thing. Let's... Boop, boop, tick. Now you guys can kind of see a little bit better, I hope. Let me see. Uh, 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 yeah. Yeah, okay, so now you can see it a, a bit better. But it's just uh, the same two monitors that I had on the other wall. And now I have this table in here that I mentioned pulling out of storage. And everything's just kind of crammed onto it for the time being but well, you can see like I just got done doing everything I just drilled all the holes to mount that stuff and everything else but um I guess there's the rest of my update as well as the unboxing video ta-da but mm, I'm thinking I'm gonna aim for Wednesday starting with normal videos. I'm still gonna get this one up hopefully tomorrow but uh, back to gameplay videos I'm gonna try for Wednesday 
no promises. I will probably keep you guys updated on Twitter with uh, details as far as I figure them out. But thank you guys so very much for watching. I love and appreciate every single one of you. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.